this is Tara. I'm standing outside of the Newmarket Municipal Building. I just had a meeting with Regional Councillor John Taylor, and he uh, has a lot to say about the water bottle ban. He passed a motion within Council to ban the use of the plastic water bottles within Council Chambers and Committee meetings. We're all going to pick something. And I said, so I decided to pick the water bottles. So I'm John Taylor, I'm the Regional Councillor for Newmarket, and uh, you know, over the past year, like a lot of people, I've been hearing a lot about uh, water bottles, I've been learning a lot about water bottles, and, uh, and uh, you know, there's, the biggest thing for me is, is that, you know, I always think about, well, what can I do, and there's always more you can do, but what is, what is certainly, let's find out the easy things I can do to, to make a difference environmentally, to improve things, and, and I've been doing things, I drive a hybrid car, for example, um, and, uh, but the, uh, you know, the whole water bottles thing, as I read more about it, I thought about it, I thought, you know what, uh, the health question is debatable. Um, I think there may be real health concerns, but it's it's not. But but in terms of the environment and in terms of garbage, there's just no question that these things are, seem to be everywhere, and uh, they're largely unnecessary. I mean, you could possibly argue totally unnecessary. But anyway, um, my thinking on it was just that this is something I, I remember about two, no, three months ago. I said, you know what, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop using water bottles except in the most extreme circumstances or or reasonable circumstances, and. The part that shocked me was how easy it was. I thought it was going to be okay. This is like a real, you know, effort I'm going to make. It wasn't an effort at all. It was unbelievably easy. So then, um, I sit on the solid waste committee at the region for the region of New York, and uh, where we deal with all the garbage from New York region. And I, I brought asked for a report on water bottles, and the report basically said, well, let's discourage people from using them. And I said, well, let's let's go one little tiny step further. There's so much more we could do. We could consider banning them in all our facilities, etc. So how about as a council, we just make a symbolic gesture and say. We're going to ban them, eliminate them from our council chamber and all our committee rooms where we do our work as politicians where I sit. And after all, we've got water containers and glasses in front of us. Um, but at least it sends a message, you know, that we mean what we're saying. And, and one step hopefully will lead to the next step. And uh, we had, had, a, we had a, a bit of a debate about it, but uh, it passed that committee. And so now it'll go to regional council next Thursday. And I'm hoping it'll be supported there. And uh, mm -hmm. well, it's a tiny step, I think. This is how a lot of these changes occur, you know, a little more awareness, a little more people thinking about it. I mean, now every member of regional council will think about it, have a discussion about it, and possibly, uh, and hopefully when it passes, um, they'll, they'll start to realize how easy this is, and, and it snowballs. And so I think there's a lot of people out there that want to see a lot less water bottles, if, if not none, and so there's a little tiny step in the right direction. Okay, so uh, recently at the Solid Waste Committee uh, at the Region of New York, I introduced a motion, um, a very modest one, I, I thought, as a, as a good first step, which was to uh, eliminate the use of plastic water bottles in the council chamber and in uh, committees, committee rooms. Um, and uh, we had an interesting debate about it, but at the end of the day, the committee, uh, the majority of the committee supported uh, the motion, and it went to full regional council for ratification. Um, and at regional council, I'm pleased to say, uh, this past uh, Thursday, uh, regional council unanimously endorsed uh, the, the, the ban of water bottles in uh, in committee rooms and in the council chambers, and so uh, you know, I'm very pleased. I think it's a good, uh, good first step, and uh, I think we have to, in the future, uh, look towards addressing uh, this uh, this issue on a less symbolic way and a more substantive way. And I think uh, certainly that's got to uh, the, a, a logical next step would be to eliminate uh, their use in all regional uh, facilities and buildings where our employees work and where the public visit us. Um, and hopefully that can uh, lead to uh, to greater movement, uh, you know, throughout all of our communities and throughout the province. Um. Please check back in to see what other initiatives Regional Councillor John Taylor has put forward. I'm Regional Councillor John Taylor, and I support the change.